Hello, welcome back to more Pokemon Fire Red. You're going to notice some uh, very different things about my Pokemon. Yeah, their levels are gone up higher. Why? Because I went on Route 3, and considering the capture device I was using was lagging like hell, I couldn't deal with that. So, I had to switch things around, get a different capture device, one I already had. I had been using like a cheap one, so I guess that's my fault. But anyway, now I'm using Pinnac Pinnacle Studio 12, and after all that fighting, Ace is now 21, Static is 15, and trust me, you didn't miss much. Oh, oh, now I have the running shoes, when you, because when you come here, First Oak's aide will be standing here, and he'll give you the running shoes, which was a gift from your mom, and it has a note attached to it, blah blah blah, I love you. And now we can run. And all these trainers, all they have is nothing but Rattatas, Pidgeys, Metapods, Kakunas, Caterpies, Weedles. That's all. And all these girls always accused me of either looking at them, touching them, or something like that. And there's the guy with the talking about his shorts and how comfy they are. Plus, I caught a bunch of uh, Pokemon uh, in this area. There was Jigglypuff. Spiro, Nidoran, Mail, and a Mankey. That's what I did there. That girl back there had a Jigglypuff. Okay, let's see. That guy's not a trainer. Plus, I ran around a bit in Mount Moon. I was trying to catch my next Pokemon. I wanted it in there, but I couldn't find it yet. I didn't want to get too far in there anyway. And that's a lot of where Ace's levels came up, because I ran into a lot of Parises. You know, the little grass bug type. So that's how he got so high level. And plus, Static kept dying over and over, because he was such a low level and defensive suck. But now he's at a high enough level to where he can hold his own, or at least do more damage. So I'm going to deposit some Pokemon. Like, I don't need this. Need that. But you can see which ones I had, like Nidoran, Jigova, Mankey, Spiro, Zubat, and Paris. Like I said, it's gonna the only reason I'm doing it is because of the national Pokedex. Oh, what's this guy? Uh, Team Rocket attacks civilian citizens. Not a day goes by without Team Rocket being in the news. Mmm, Team Rocket. Foreshadowing. It's a newspaper. Actually, it looks more like a clipboard. Ah, this guy. Hello there, laddie. Have I got a deal just for you? I'll let you have a secret Pokemon. A magic card which is 500 Pokemon dollars. So you buy him, right? No! No, you say no, you say no. I'm only doing you a favor. Why? You can catch a magic card for free. Unless you just want one now, considering you don't have a rod. It's up to you. I did it once a long time ago. But I don't think it's really that much worth it, considering how hard it is to level up Magikarps. Ah, Mount Woman. You can at least switch back. Because last time I was running in here, there was nothing but Zubats. Nothing but Zubats. Uh, well, let's see, I don't have a grass type. Yeah, there it is, Zubat. Supposed to be Geodudes here, too, but I've just seen nothing but Zubats. Zubat's an annoying Pokemon. It's still the type of Pokemon you hate, you hate it and like it at the same time. Actually, Zubat sucks, only because it's so hard to level up. Because of its bad moves. I think it's a good move bite later on and then wing attack. Suspicious men are in the cave. What about you? I don't know. I'm only 10, so... I'm not a man. What about you? You're suspicious. Why is a bug catcher in a cave? Hopefully you can do more damage now, Static. Yes, yes you can.
actually, that Magikarp guy was in the Pokemon anime where he so he sold one to James when they they were on the SSN, and James got like pissed at it because, well, at the time it was worthless. He kicked it and got pissed and turned into a Gyarados. I'd say the old Pokemon episodes were more. They had more variety to them back then. Now every episode is pretty much the same. Actually, there was a recurring theme. He, like, every once in a while, James would run into that same guy. Again, trying to sell him something. You got me. We're in the Mount Moon episode. They won. They were talking about uh, Clefairy. And that was the first time... I remember that was the first time you saw... Oh, there's a Geo dude. Hmm. I'm gonna catch it. I don't know how much damage will this do. Not much. It's kind of redundant considering electric attacks won't affect it anyway. But yeah, this is the first time you saw Misty use her own Pokemon. It was Star U against Meowth, and then Brock caught a Zubat, which they didn't really show. He just threw it out, and Ash is like, where'd you get that? He's like, I caught it on the way in, and Ash is like, I should have done that. Because there was a whole bunch of Zubat attacking, uh, that, it was that weird professor guy that was obsessed with the, uh, Clefairy, and Ash had Pikachu's Thundershock on it. And when Brock caught it, I don't know, because Ash was standing, like, right next to him when all that went down. But okay, that's fine. Well, we got you, dude. That's another entry to the Pokedex. Uh, it's round four and makes it easy to pick up. Some people have used them to hurl at each other in a snowball fight. What? What kind of sadistic people pick up a Geodude, a Rock-type Pokemon, and throw it at each other? That's... Yes, that is kind of brutal. I won't lie. That's a weird Pokedex entry. Look at that Pokedex. I've seen 21, I've owned 14. No, not Water's Edge, uh, let's see, Cave. Yeah, it's 44 pounds. No, oh, I didn't read that sign. What? I'm waiting for my friends to find me here. Why are you waiting inside a cave? Les Iris would like to battle. Now, oh, see, you have the thing I'm looking for. Yeah, I'm looking for a fairy. What of it? Oh man, that's... Hmm. Well, Growl didn't really matter. That's just low to my attack, not my special attack. Oh no, it's going for Sing. That's not annoying at all. I bet it has double slap too. How'd I know that? Well, you got paralyzed, so there you go. Hopefully this other mic I'm using will cut out background noise. Maybe you won't hear me clicking my controller in the background so much. Then again, this is a Majora's Mask when I'm spinning attack, doing the spinning attack 24-7. Encore. Well, it's kind of pointless at the moment. That's just going to make me use the same move over and over, which I've been doing anyway. I wonder if it takes up PP when I do that. Oh, come on. This thing is like, has 55 accuracy, I think. Oh, 
what a double slap. I knew it. Uh, I'm still asleep. You bastard, wake up! You think being slapped would wake you up? Come on. Thank you. Two hundred four experience. I lost. Yes, you did. Um. Well, I'm close to the entrance, so I can just run back to the Pokemon Center. Okay, now... I've only got three Pokeballs left. All of them will be used for Clefairy. Hopefully I'll just need one. Well, who knows, my luck turned bad. I ran the Geodude once. What's on this floor? There's a ladder here. I've already been here. This is where the Paris are. Now they're supposed to be rare, but I just ran into them non-stop. Ooh, who's that? We, Team Rocket, are Pokemon gangsters. We strike fear with our strength. Ah, this is Team Rocket. Our first Team Rocket member. I don't know why they didn't put Jesse and James in this one. They were Pokemon Yellow. Went nice. Oh, that's not gonna work. Well, there's no any ground to it. Oh, it doesn't matter. I'm basically gonna go for sand. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. Oh, we're, we're gonna do this whole thing. Oh, that takes care of that. Right, so well, his accuracy is down. I don't want to risk that. What you're going to use? Yep, I knew it. Lost my train of thought. You at that? You at should be too difficult. All right, good. He's down. Our first team rocket number down. I blew it. Yes, you did. I was facing the other way, huh? Darn it all, my associates won't stand for this. Hmm, too bad. Oh, what's this? Star piece, uh, that's just good for selling your money. Wild zoom bat. Level up. 
you know, pay right before I get to the ladder. Attack is higher than its special attack. It's okay, it's not by that much. Yes, Paris. Yeah, Paris. Yeah, I'm not bothering that, but that one. It seems to be only on. Paris only shows up like here. You know, supposed to be, uh, supposed to be rare. So we Clefairy's gotta be further down. Alright, out of here. Uh, let's see, there's some items. I don't even have a repel, I didn't even bother buying them. They're a little bit too expensive for me at this point in the game. So we have uh, yeah, I think I've got ten potions. And I have like ten Pokeballs. And that's the extent of what I spent my money on. Oh, like an antidote, paralyze, heal. There's a scientist. Zoom that, zoom that, zoom that. You know it's so weird? In Generation 5, there's like... There's only 5th generation Pokemon in that game. Well, at least... Uh... Until after the post game, I think. I think so. But it's kind of weird not running into the zoo pad all the time. As it technically has been replaced with Woobat. Whatever you call it, Woobat. Oh, it's not a scientist, it's a nerd. What's the difference? Magnemite. Heart steel, this should be difficult. <clears throat> and Voltorb. I don't like Voltorbs either. I don't know why. I think. Maybe because they're so fast. That's probably why I don't like them. I've never used one though. First rare candy. I usually don't use those who like way at the end of the game. Well, I'm at the Elite Four, and I think. What's the best Pokemon I need to level up if I'm under leveled? I'm gonna try to make sure I'm leveled up enough. At least 40, 45, before I turn on the Elite Four. So I don't have to struggle so much. Well, yeah, I kind of figured that. There's nowhere else I can go. You bug catchers. Oh, come on. You should have a Butterfree by now. Taking this method, will you have a Butterfree at the end? No, you suck. You fail as a bug catcher. Yes, you did lose. Because you suck. What's this? Uh, escape rope. Well, it can come in handy in case of an emergency. Wild Zubat appeared. I probably should be more careful when just attacking all these wild Pokemon. Otherwise, I'm gonna run out of PP for Ember.
guy standing up there. Oh, never mind. Wow, it's bigger in here than I thought. Well, it is a cave, but... Oh, great, I switch and then... Oh, let me go for an attack. Eh, not bad, I guess. Not bad. Oh, he's probably gonna keep using absorb. Yeah, that's it's gonna make the fight drag on fat uh, more than I would actually like it to. That's about. Uh, you know what? Just an ace, so we can end this quickly. job here, get lost kid. What, standing around doing nothing? It's convenient for a Zubat. That should be no problem. Do Zubats know Super Sonic at this level? That's probably another reason I don't like fighting them. They tend to know Super Sonic and it tends to always hit. Ekans. Well, in the anime, Pikachu usually always owned Ekans. I think in Team Rocket, he just... Well... I should say Jesse and James were kind of pathetic. Oh, I bet I'll get poisoned. Eh, hey, yep, I knew it. Actually, they were kind of threatening someone in the very beginning, and then after a while, it's like, they're kind of redundant, because they're just, they're episode fillers. Like, they just, they just need, they're just there to, like, extend the episode, and nothing else. Oh, right, when you give a Pokemon an item, this little screen pops up. It actually shows how attached your Pokemon is to you. Because the closer your Pokemon pops to you, that means that the higher its happiness rating, or, you know, that's what, whatever you call it. The. Uh, it's not like you feel if you're trying to get an item from certain Pokemon. Will I find anything down here? Besides Paris, I think the fairies tend to, be, tend to be in these latter areas. No. I didn't come to explore. I just want to get from point A to point B. 
I don't like caves. I don't know anyone that actually does like caves. Of course. Always use quick attack. So I don't like radishes. Well, one of the reasons they always use quick attack. Sorry, buddy. 